Uh, federal investigators are heading to Miami International Airport today to determine what caused a plane to catch fire when it landed, injuring at least three people. Ileana Diaz is live there with more. Ileana. Good morning, Adrian. 126 people were on that red airplane when it had to crash land and then it caught on fire. I'm going to show you a live look here. I'm going to step out of the way. As we zoom in, what you're going to see is that red airplane still there on the tarmac. There are two fire trucks standing by right there alongside the airplane. Now we are seeing some other planes coming through around the area, so it looks like some of the runways may now have been open, but NTSB investigators are expected to show up this morning to figure out what went wrong and see whether or not any of this could have been prevented. This morning, the NTSB is sending a team to find out what caused this plane's landing gear to collapse and catch fire while landing at Miami International Airport. Shout out Miami Dade. Picking up all the passengers. Looks like they all made it, thank God. Vers just outside of the airport, watching it all unfold. Mira la gente tirándose, mira. <gasps> that driver saying, look at the people jumping out. Look, firefighters were quickly able to douse the plane in foam and prevent a fire or fuel leak from spreading further. The plane was arriving in Miami after taking off from Santo Domingo in the Dominican Republic when that landing gear collapsed, causing it to land on its belly. It was operated by Red Air, a budget airline that only flies between Santo Domingo and Miami. And Red Air is a fairly new airline. They started last year. Right now, they only fly between Miami and Santo Domingo, but they said they are hoping to expand over the next year or two. And yesterday, the mayor was here on the scene. She responded just a couple of minutes after it happened, and she said that fire crews were able to respond within minutes. And luckily, as we mentioned earlier, only three people were hospitalized with minor injuries. Adrian. All right, Ileana, thank you very much. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.